you have any type of pointers for writing posts. That's where I constantly struggle, and I simply wind up looking empty display for a very long time. I mean, a lot of stuff I kind of just make up in the moment, but when I do script stuff out, um, I try to just, like, organize my thoughts as best I can, and chances are you're gonna have to go back over it a couple times, you know, go back and read what you wrote. I guess that would be my advice? I don't know. Oh wow, here's one from way back. Way back, episode 29. Have you ever thought about publishing an ebook or guest authoring on other websites? I have a blog based upon on some on the same topics you discuss and would love to have you share some stories information. I know my subscribers would enjoy your work. If you're even remotely interested, feel free to shoot me an email. I have enough trouble getting content for this site. I don't know how much content I could also give away to other sites. So if anyone was wondering, if you do the same thing I do, I'm probably just going to put that on here. <laughs> Sorry. Do you have any type of suggestions for creating articles? That's where I always struggle. As well as I just end up looking. Empty displays. Go, go, go to a writing blog. Go, go to a writing blog. I don't know what to tell you. It's not, it's not here. Do you have any kind of suggestion? <laughs> Your writing is fine and gives food for thought. I hope that I'll have more time to read your articles. Regards. I wish you that you frequently publish new texts and invite you to greet me. I'll take that as a positive piece of feedback. It's all I can do. Do you have any type of tips for creating articles? No. No, I don't. I'm not good at it. Stop asking me. There are more ideas that negate this. Can I? Sure. You could have just written that in the comment. That's how comments work. I'm on pins and needles wondering what they wanted to say now. Do you have any kind of suggestions for composing write-ups? Oh, I see what you did there. Clever, but no. I'm on to you. I'm on to you now. That's the same question. I can tell that you're so willfully ignorant with this opinion just to rebel. I didn't have opinions. We did an interview. So, someone necessarily lend a hand to make seriously posts, I'd state. You'd state badly, but okay. This is the first time I frequented your website page, and to this point? I am amazed with the research you made to make this particular post incredible. Magnificent activity! I love the enthusiasm. I'll take it. Quite well written, if a bit PC. Explain? I can't. I don't know what you're talking about. So there. Do you have any kind of suggestions for creating short articles? Again. Real sneaky, but I'm not taking the bait. So well put, but a bit appeasing. Explain? Again? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Thanks for writing in, I guess. You make some compelling arguments within this entry, but are you oversimplifying something fundamental? Like what? <laughs> Enlighten me. There's no follow-up. These open-ended questions that ask me to ask a question are so infuriating. <laughs> Hi, you have a very easy to follow site. It was very easy to post. Fantastic. Yeah, it seems super easy to post in our spam folder. I mean, all you have to do is look at the 2.6 thousand spam comments we received <laughs> for Delve 202 alone. I will never run out of content for these.
Hi, I hope this mail meets you well. My name is Nathan, from the U.S. I know this may seem inappropriate, but I wish to get to know you better. I am looking for a relationship in which I will feel loved. All I need is just your attention and the chance to know you more. Did I send this? Did, did, did I send this to you? Is this me from the future? I'm scared. <laughs>